What is the secret to a long and happy life? This question has intrigued humans for centuries. Could the answer lie within the Japanese concept of Ikigai? In the heart of Japan, authors Hector Garcia and Francesc Miral stumbled upon this age-old question. Their exploration culminated in the insightful book, The Japanese Secret to a Long and Happy Life. At the crux of their findings is a term you might not be familiar with, Ikigai. Ikigai, a unique Japanese philosophy, loosely translates to a reason for being. It's the sweet spot where your passion, mission, vocation and profession intersect. It's about finding joy, fulfillment and balance in the daily routine of life. Imagine waking up each day with a clear purpose, an inner drive that propels you forward. That's the power of Ikigai. Garcia and Morales believe that discovering and pursuing your Ikigai could be your first step towards a longer and more fulfilling life. Beyond Ikigai, the book delves into various aspects of Japanese culture that contribute to well-being. A balanced diet, regular physical activity, and strong social connections are integral parts of this culture. The importance of these habits in promoting a longer and healthier life cannot be overstated. The book also introduces the concept of mindfulness, a practice deeply rooted in Japanese traditions. Mindfulness is all about being present in the moment, fully engaged in whatever you're doing, free from distraction or judgment. It's about breathing in and knowing you're breathing in. It's about appreciating the here and now. Japanese traditions, from the meditative brewing and sipping of tea to the practice of Zen Buddhism, encourage this state of mindfulness. They teach us to slow down, to be present, and to savor each moment. Adopting these healthy habits and cultivating mindfulness, according to the authors, can significantly enhance your life quality and longevity. The authors further explore the therapeutic benefits of nature, the concept of positive aging, and the role of community in Japanese culture. Stepping into the embrace of nature, we find ourselves amid the Japanese practice of forest bathing or Shinrin-yoku. This is no ordinary walk in the park. It's a mindful immersion in the natural world. A chance to soak in the greenery, breathe in the fresh air, and let the tranquility wash over us. Each rustle of leaves, each bird's song, every whisper of the wind is a note in the symphony of nature's healing. It's a stress reliever, a mood booster, and a health enhancer, all rolled into one. Now let's take a detour from the green trails of the forest to the golden years of life. The Western notion of retirement often paints a picture of slowing down, of stepping back. But in the land of the rising sun, a different perspective shines. Here we find the concept of Ikigai retirement. Instead of an end to productive life, it's seen as a new chapter, a chance to reallocate time and energy to what gives life purpose and joy. It's about staying active, engaged and filled with a sense of purpose, even as the years roll on. But what fuels this purpose, this joy? A significant part of it springs from the well of community and social bonds. In Japan, the sense of community isn't just about living in proximity. It's about living together, sharing experiences, supporting one another. It's about the warmth of friendships, the joy of shared laughter, the comfort of a shoulder to lean on. It's about being intertwined in the tapestry of life, each thread strengthening the other, each bond adding to the richness of the experience. By embracing nature, viewing aging positively, and fostering strong community bonds, you may unlock the secret to a happier and longer life. So, what have we learned from the Japanese secret to a long and happy life? Quite a bit, indeed. Central to this enlightening journey is the concept of Ikigai, the intersection of one's passion, mission, vocation, and profession. It's the reason for being, the lifeblood of happiness and longevity. Alongside Ikigai, we've explored the significance of healthy habits in Japanese culture, from a balanced diet to regular physical activity and strong social connections. We've also delved into the role of mindfulness in reducing stress and promoting mental well-being, and the therapeutic benefits of embracing nature through practices like forest bathing. We've challenged the Western notion of retirement, discovering the Japanese approach to positive aging and the concept of Ikigai retirement. And, of course, we've underscored the importance of strong social connections and a sense of community in fostering a sense of purpose and joy. It appears the secret to a long and happy life isn't so secret after all. It's about finding your Ikigai, living healthily, staying mindful, appreciating nature, aging positively, 
and cultivating strong community bonds. Now, isn't that a secret worth sharing? Thank you for watching. We would greatly appreciate it if you could subscribe to become a part of our community and stay updated.